Hello, this is Leo at the Lead Time. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to extract Centella exotica by using steam distillation. At the end of the video, I will show you how to make a Centella exotica facial mask. I'm using organic dry Centella exotica. Centella exotica can absorb a lot of pollutants from the water when it's growing. Because of that, it's become more important to use organic material. We don't want the heavy metals or other bad stuff, so we'll go, to, go into our distillate. Centella exotica is a water love plant with a unique round shaped leaf and a straw like stem. The plant also has the name of a go to color tiger grass, pennyworth. There is a story about its name, a tiger grass. In old time, people found when wild tiger got hurt, they would go to the place where Centella exotica grows. Tiger rolled and scratched on the grass. It got his wound healed from this magic plant. Therefore, it has the name of a tiger grass. This small plant is used as a green leaf vegetable and a medicinal herb. Many scientific studies report Centella exotica as a showing important health benefits like uh, anti-diabetic, wound healing, antimicrobial, memory enhancing, antioxidant, and neuroprotecting activities. Due to its good anti-inflammation and antioxidant properties, Centella exotica is a powerful skincare material. Skin can get damaged in the environment because of free radicals and oxidants which can cause skin cell dysfunction and wrinkles. Antioxidants may slow or prevent the oxidation so as to prevent damage and help anti-aging and keep skin smooth. Centella exotica, also called a Sika, in K Cosmetics, its extract is a sensitive skin-friendly ingredient and help calm inflammation, redness, and irritated skin. How to make a Centella exotica extract? Basically. A solvent or process is used to extract the functional compounds out of the plant material. Steam distillation is a water solvent extraction method plus heat extraction. Research showed steam distilled Centella exotica extract is a very strong antioxidant. It is equally powerful as a synthesized antioxidant. The difference is that a plant-based extract has been proved for hundreds of years not only for its efficacy, but also for its safety. Fresh leaf has 80 to 90% of water. After drying, they lose the water. So today I'm using the 100 gram of the dry leaf. That means like 500 gram of uh, the fresh leaf. That's a lot. So you can see, so you understand why the hydrosol can be so concentrated because you're doing the distillation from that much of the leaf material. And I'm gonna add in the, I'm gonna in the spray bottle. Centella exotica, hydrosol has a little bitter smell and uh, it does like a make a wake up spray. This uh, hydrosol is a very good as a skin moisturizer, toner, and also help a deep clean the skin. Actually, those hydrosol and the paste are very concentrated. In the commercial product, they normally use like 1%. It already gives you a very good um, performance. So, I would recommend you start by diluting it 
Uh, hydrosol you can dilute by 10 times. In a spray bottle, like a 100 ml, milliliter bottle, you can add a 10 milliliter of uh, the hydrosol and uh, dilute by 10 times. And the paste, you can scoop uh, like a one tenth of uh, the other material you like and you mix with them, make your own uh, facial mask. The rest of the paste you can freeze it and you can put it in the, even a small bag of each uh, batch so you think you will use and then you froze them. So next time you just take it out and, and use to make your own the facial mask. Thank you for watching today's video. If you have questions, please leave it at the bottom. And also if you have any comments or suggestions or what hydrosol you are using, and which your favorite hydrosol, please also leave here. Subscribe the channel if you haven't done yet. Like the video, share with your friends if you think it's good. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.